I cannot believe what a parenting fail that is. You just <laughs> quietly sat there watching Ryler get stacks of cash. Just counted up all the stuff. Yeah, you guys are not gonna like it. Hello and good morning everyone. Welcome back. Happy February 1st. Today starts the month of love and I'm so excited. February is so fun because you know what? It inches us that much closer to spring. We've had really awesome weather. Just got a notification on my phone that it's gonna start raining, which means it is the start of the yucky weather and it's fine. We've had a couple of great days. It's like it breathed life into us. We know like sunny days are ahead. We can do this. It's been a great morning so far because I'm doing early workouts before the kids wake up. I have the whole day today and I'm like, what will I do? Do. I have the biggest box of returns. I can't even tell you how big this box of returns is. I have been killing myself trying to get the boys dress suits for church. And sizing is funny, difficult, it's challenging. Bought four suits for Brexen. Finally, I think, figured out which size he needs on which brand and blah. Been such an effort. And crew, I bought him a suit. It's so dumb. I only bought the jacket. I didn't buy the pants. So I just got that separate shipment. But my return pile for Amazon, the UPS orders, it's quite big. Been working on that this morning. Just like laundry, those kind of things. Just wanted to jump in here this afternoon and say, I hope you're having a great start to your day, great start to your month. My nails feel very festive with the pink and the hearts. I love it. Today I did wear pink tank top to the gym and pink socks. I felt very festive. Oh, this is one thing I wanted to tell you guys. You haven't been on our site. This is howwebingham.com. If you go to the shop tab, you'll see our sweatshirts have been marked down dramatically. There are still a couple of sizes left there. So if you wanted one, didn't get one, you can go check and see if your size is available. If you're like teeter-tottering on the size that are available that are marked down, maybe you could size up. Oversized is totally in style. I am wearing a particularly big baggy sweatshirt today and love it. It's super comfy. Go on over. There are a couple items marked down. There's no code needed or anything. Check it out. You can get one for a gift and for yourself. Check it out. Also, the tumblers are still marked down. We've always been so grateful for all the love and support from you and being here every day. Being part of this is how we bing them, but we wanted to tell you a giant thank you. Give this video a thumbs up. Thank you for being here. I went grocery shopping yesterday. I did a big grocery shopping at Walmart. You know, you forget the one thing you need every time I did that. I do it every single time. I needed molasses. I actually needed this since December 23rd, 24th. We wanted to make gingerbread cookies for Santa. You guys, I didn't have molasses. I thought I did, and it was like Christmas Eve. There was not a chance I was gonna go to the store. We made different cookies. Hazy red, I think we talked about this yesterday. I survived the great molasses flood. I also read this yesterday. Wrote a report on it. She did such a good job. I'm actually laughing because you didn't know she had taken the camera and talked to it so much. It's really funny. Part of that project, she needs to do a project with it. So she could choose a variety of things. And I said, okay, there are a lot of recipes that have really yummy ingredients in them like molasses. So why don't we make some molasses cookies? Oh my gosh, we have to make molasses cookies. Found some recipes on Pinterest. Had to make an order for molasses today. Just made a couple items that needed to be delivered. Hazel has decided for her dinner tonight. She wants to go really fancy. I'm talking real fancy. Mac and cheese and hot dogs, which is what she wanted last week. We had mac and cheese chicken nuggets, which was amazing. Buffalo sauce. Kind of asked her to wait a week. This is my favorite cheese sauce. It's so good. I ordered some more cheese sauce. I just ordered a couple of things. I'm waiting for Brandon to get home with the kids. I have just been working on laundry and dishes. I'm kind of sitting in the house going, it's like really clean. Come on kids, come home so you can play with me. <laughs> Guys, Brexton's got a friend over and they wanted to go outside and shoot hoops. So Brexton said, let me run upstairs and change. And he changed into Ugg slippers and a robe. <laughs> I just love how Brexton is just Brexton. He is just a unique individual and does not really care what anybody else says or thinks. When it's basketball time, it's cold outside, he's getting a robe. Maybe he's using the force. Maybe it's a Jedi robe. So we are doing a little bit of the after school homework and chore routine here. And actually, I don't know, should I tell everybody what's happening right now, crew? Sure. Not gonna bring this up, actually. I was just gonna talk about how Ryler is off right now with mom at a day of kindness or a choose kindness event for the student council. They're getting together and building like hygiene kits and some other things for people in need. So that is a really cool thing that the student council is doing for the school. Ryler, as a member of the student council, is off doing that and mom took him. So that's where they are. Brexton is here playing with a friend. They're shooting some hoops. Hazy just finished reading and crew is on the laptop. And I might as well just come clean with what's happening here because it's it's gonna be a fun series of events to watch unfold. Ryler, as you guys know, recently got a Steam Deck for Christmas, and then I sold my Steam Deck and upgraded to the OLED model. <laughs> you are so dumb. I think we've put all of that in the vlog. And when that was as easy as it was, <laughs> 
freaking, which is so simple to sell mine. It's holding like three minutes. And I took the cash and put it towards the OLED model, which isn't a lot more than the LCD model. And as boring as all of that probably is to most of you, the end result of that was I just kind of said, somewhat jokingly, but somewhat serious, man, that was so easy. You should do it. <laughs> yeah! Woo! <laughs> Steam Deck, baby, yeah! So what that turned into is Ryler more or less announcing that his Steam Deck is available for purchase. He found an interested party willing to pay top dollar for it. And so I said, well, you just gotta come up with the upgrade fee, the difference in price between the LCD model, the one that he got for Christmas, and the OLED model. And then, sure, why not? You can definitely get it. So as he went to go do that, he was looking at the grade money that he didn't get from last term. So we typically pay a certain dollar amount per A. So that's what I thought we were doing, getting around to the end of the story here. Per A, and then if you get straight A's, like a little bonus kicker of an additional amount of money. And if you get straight A's for the entire year, there's an additional kicker there. So just some incentives along the way to keep you motivated as you go through the school year. Well, I brought this up to mom. And I said, hey, Mindy, I don't know what your thoughts are on this. I know you don't love the devices in the home in general. So what do you think about Ryler taking his A money, using that towards the upgrade? If you found somebody to buy it, then I really enjoyed it. I'll be honest. I think it was like a worthwhile upgrade, a more significant difference than I realized. So I was on board. Mom was seemingly on board with the idea in theory until she realized, I don't think we've ever paid for anything except 4.0s, which means all of the times that crew got a ton of A's, but not a 4.0, never paid you. Yeah. Is that true? We never paid you for getting A's on your report yeah. card. Dude. It's kind of I cannot believe what a parenting fail that is. You just <laughs> quietly sat there watching Ryler get stacks of cash and walk away and buy iPads, buy all kinds of random anchor bricks that he's been buying, whatever the heck he gets with that money. And you just quietly knew that you had like 50 to 70 bucks that you could have asked for, but you're like, nah, I'm good. Yeah, so I just counted up all the stuff from seventh grade and yeah, you guys are not gonna like it. Went well, back and looked up your grade? My mom was saying, she was like, oh hold no, up, hold up. Bad. Go okay, to so this is where it's kind of evolved into something a little bit more <laughs> because mom, in an effort to write the whole situation, she feels like I'm making it a little bit too easy on Ryler to upgrade his Steam Deck. He should have to patiently wait and earn and hold on to that cash. I was saying it's not really anything he has to wait for. It's cash that he has on hand. So I don't really see the point in that. She's saying, okay, if that's the way it is, then we need to go back to the beginning of seventh grade, count up every single A that crew has gotten. We need to rectify that and pay him for that. The so crew, do you know the total? Do you have, do you have any idea how much oh, we're out? Yeah. Are we still going to be able to go on our cruise? Do we have to cancel the cruise? See if we can get no. a partial refund. I think we have to cancel the rest of the year. <laughs> I went through, did the math, checks out, even though he's from the future. It's, uh, <laughs> yeah, we're in a little bit of trouble here. So just a bit. this is, I mean, there's so many lessons to be learned. One, work and study hard in school because it could pay. Two, make sure you pay and settle your debts as they occur because it can really add up if you're not careful. It's definitely. And then like maybe C3 or D, I don't really know what we're on. B, like crew who can quietly go a year and a half without even saying a word about never getting paid for his grade, you goofball. So it turns out we've got 24 A's that we haven't paid out. Are you sure we so, haven't paid any? Anything on these? I have these right here from first term for five. Okay, dude. I'm first actually, term. so wait, hold up. Is that an A plus or an A minus? Are we gonna do A minuses? Five bucks no. for an A minus or just not counting it at if all? If we do five bucks Boy, for an A minus. it would really help us if you didn't count it. Okay, so the other thing is, and I'm gonna put this out there because I think it's just important that it's full transparency. Everyone knows what we're working with here. Ryler sold Crew his iPad. When Ryler got an iPhone, he didn't really see the need for an iPhone anymore. So he said, Crew, I'm gonna give you this iPad, kind of on layaway, I guess. But nobody watching this knows what layaway is. <laughs> and have it now and then pay me as you get money. And one of the he specifically said is as you get your good grade money, just give it to me and that will pay it off. He actually even made up like a contract where if he didn't pay it by the end of the year, last year, 2023, start to accrue interest. Like every week or every day, it would go up X amount. I don't know what exactly the deal was. But then rather was feeling extra generous. We were in Florida. He just got his Steam Deck. Like life was feeling pretty good. So crew had not settled the debt and Ryler's like, ah, oh, it's just fine. You can just have it. Don't worry about it. Which was very nice of him. I was told Ryler, this is the time when you'd probably want a little bit of that money from the iPad to help you out when you need the Steam Deck. You don't need yeah. the Steam Deck that you want. I'm working with crew right now to figure out if we can in some way settle up with Rye Guy because you did get a free iPad out of that. He gifted to you. So maybe we can give him something. Maybe just what he needs to get there, you know? So then he's he's taken care of. But I do think we owe you big time. I think so too. You've earned it. It's not the kind of thing that you're like asking for unreasonably. You've earned it. You didn't even ask for it. It was when I went to go give Ryler money that I realized we've never paid you in a year and a half. Dude, this is like one of the biggest parenting fails in the history. <laughs> We got double duty going on in the kitchen right now. Daisy is doing her book report project. Did I do it yes. Good? Which is making gingerbread cookies, is that right? Molasses. Molasses cookies, cookies. Molasses okay. Cookies. 
book. I also read The Great Molasses, Led 1919. Uh, gingerbread Cookies has molasses in it. So you're making molasses cookies for the whole class. That is pretty genius to butter up the judges on your book report, because I gotta think, you're getting an A. Although I don't know if I wanna talk about A's anymore after what we've gone through today. And the other thing that's being cooked in the kitchen right now that is hazy specific, Hazy's night for dinner. She has requested a family classic, hot dogs and mac and cheese. So we're gonna be cut up hot dogs, yeah. put them in mac and cheese. That is Hazy's choice. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty excited for this one. You might be cooking in the kitchen, but you're cooking out here. It's come time to pay the piper, quite literally, or pay the crew and pay the rye guy. We have discussed here amongst ourselves, and I do believe we've come to an arrangement and agreement that all, including mom, can get on board with, including crew, who's been slighted for the last year and a half, just suffering in silence. Man, what a deprived life you've lived. But I think we have a solution, and here's how we're gonna break it down. Crew, we do as we discussed. <laughs> That's how we're gonna break it down. You said break it down. Yeah. Decided that Kruby Do, as we discussed earlier, has 24 unpaid A's. Yes, I calculated He did get eight paid A's though, because when he got the 4.0, we paid the 4.0. Yes. So that is eight yes. A's paid, 24 additional A's. We have determined an amount that we are willing to pay for that, which is the full amount, full mm -hmm. amount. But as we discussed previously, he did get an iPad from Ryler with an mm -hmm. understanding that he True. would pay a certain amount. I think yes. it was $150 that Ryler yes. asked for. The yeah. $550 iPad, that's a very good yeah. amount. Deal, I think he was just excited to pass it along to his brother, so that's great. Mm -hmm. Because we, I think, are to blame here. And Ryler, at the end of the year, yes, we, did you ever pay crew? Yeah. <laughs> just blaming no, me. Ryler kind of forgave the debt. Really good yeah. Christmas and end of year, and he's like, you can just have it. I do you think that some compensation should be made? So yes. I think so. I'm okay with that. We have decided that we will half that. So 50% of what you okay. agreed to pay, 75 to Ryler. Crew will then get the remaining amount yes. for the rest of those A's. So confused. Ryler will get 80 for the A's that he just got, because he got eight A's, so yep. $10 an A is 80. I don't know oh. if we've ever explicitly said that, but that's how much. Adding up to your total, and you've got your total. Total, no, I think once, everyone's gonna yeah, be taken care of, right? So we got 165 and 155. Woo. Fantastic. And that, by the way, Raga needs about 150 to bridge the gap in the Steam Deck. That is gonna be exactly what you need. You just came into a nice little truckload of money that you didn't even know you were gonna get. I think in the end, it's something that everybody is genuinely yeah, excited I'm about. So excited. Everybody's brought back up to speed. Mom, do you feel like we have made amends for our biggest and potentially most expensive parenting mistake of our lives? Uh, I think so. I think that I this think so will too. even us out. It's gonna be nice and little. You little. guys should do I'm this started. more. I think what forget for a year and a half and then give you like a ton of money uh -huh. at one time. I think that works out. The cool part, you guys are in complete control of how much money you get. You it's want true. more money? Work harder, study grade. harder. This yeah. is what my parents did for me all growing up. Ten dollars an A. My Works. parents always did it too. Yeah, I got thirty bucks. Just kidding. No, I actually <laughs> I, got really good I grades. Got 10. <laughs> <laughs> I actually somehow got really good grades. I think they used to give them out back then. Anyway, we're all squared away. We're gonna get that oh. settled and paid. And who knows? Might be uh, looking for a new Steam Deck coming our way. If I guy can sell his to the appropriate buyer, we'll have to wait and see on that one. Yikes. Okay, we're gonna get these kids in bed it is getting late you actually still have practice but we've got to wind this day down you guys thanks for hanging out with us thanks for being here we'll see you all tomorrow good night everybody Bye. Bye.